Hey what's up guys this is Kef here from Noise and today in this video let's check out how you can get the iPhone 10 look and feel on your Android device. Guys if you like what you see then do hit the like, subscribe and the bell icon to be on the notification squad. The very first thing is go into your browser and search for iLauncher. It is there in the link in the description below. Download the latest version and then click on start download. I already have it installed on my phone. I am selecting my default launcher as the iLauncher. Now you can see that the launcher looks like the iOS 11 launcher. Now the second thing, go back to your browser and then search for iNoty. Yes, iNoty. And then there will be a link from apkyear.com. Again the link is there in the description below. The link to every app from the video is there in the description below. Download the latest one and start the download. It will start downloading. When you are done, hit install. Now open it up. Now enable iNoT, show the battery percentage and you can change your carrier name if you want. Then you will see that you have got the iOS 11 status bar that is the notification panel. Yes, this is a bit different from the iOS 11 one, looks like the iOS 8 or 9's but it's fine. Now the third one, download an app that is X out of 10. Yes, for the notch. I've downloaded, now start. When you go back home, you will see that you've got the notch of the iPhone 10 on your phone. It looks great. You can also arrange icons in the dock, increase or decrease the number of icons to 4, 5, whatever you want. Now go back to your browser and then search for iPhone 10 wallpaper. And download the wallpaper of iPhone 10. Now when you are done downloading, you have to set it as your wallpaper. Use as and then select as your wallpaper for the home screen and the lock screen and then you are done. Go back. So here you have got the wallpaper. Now the next thing, you have to download the control center. So download the iOS 11 control center from the play store. So this is the control center for iOS 11. Hit install. After installing, open up. Then grant all the permissions which is required by the app. You can also set the handle to pull up the control center from bottom left or right. Yes, there's no option for the top but you can pull it from the bottom. Now you get 3D touch options in the control center as well. Hold it for a longer time and then you can use 3D touch options. Yes, you can control the brightness, play music, or control volume, automatic or normal manual brightness and many more other options are present in the iOS 11 control center. Now go back to your play store and search for emoji keyboard 7 and this is the emoji keyboard 7 hit install. After you install it you have to select the white flat theme which looks the same as the iOS 11 keyboard. Now the next thing an emoji. Yes you have to download this an emoji app from the link in the description below. This is not the perfect app but it is quite good. Hey what's up guys this is Kef here from Noise and this is the Animoji for Android. Yes this is not perfect but at least not worth thousand dollars. You get many filters in this app and this is quite fun to use as well. Then you have to download an app that is rounder from the play store for the round screen corners. Yes because iPhone 10 has got the rounded corners. You can increase or decrease the density of these corners if you want. Now go back to your home screen and then you can see you've got the rounded corners of iPhone 10. So guys you've got all the features of iPhone 10 on your Android device. Thanks for watching guys because that really helps and do subscribe to our channel for more of these kind of videos. With that being said, my name's Kev, you are watching Noise Pack and we're signing out.